Warner Robins police say crew lounge has become a public safety concern. So now they're looking to revoke the club's business license. Two weeks ago, three women were wounded in the crew parking lot. Police say it started with two women arguing over a man. They say the suspect, 24-year-old Caitlin Green, knew the three people she shot. Green is in the Houston County Jail facing three counts of aggravated assault. Now folks may soon have to find a new place to go clubbing in Warner Robins. Megan Western explains why the chief says the problems run deeper than this one incident. Across from Robbins Air Force Base, right next to the Russell Parkway exit, sits Crew Lounge. Now, the slogan is catch a vibe, but police say you'll see or get a lot more. There have been multiple events uh, that have been aggravated assault, shooting, stabbings. Uh, there's been a homicide out there. The homicide back in 2022, claiming the life of a 24-year-old. From January 22 uh, to present, there were roughly 146 events at this business location that required a police response. Police Chief Wayne Fisher says they also don't have licensed security. Last month, they arrested a man working under an expired security license. There were five cases that we could show that he had been working outside the scope of his license. Fisher says they've taken steps to help the business owner with safety, like placing signs and having police officers hired to patrol. Those that had chose to work for him have also exercised their right not to want to work in a part-time capacity due to what they're observing in the, uh, if you will, conflicts that were being created. Now Chief Fisher says that he's writing up a proposal to Warner Robins City Council leaders, asking them to revoke the business license here at Crew. He's going through Superior Court on a civil action as well. Fisher says while the police respond to calls, it's not their job to keep a business safe. The business owner has the responsibility to make sure that he's providing a safe environment for his patron. Which he says crew has failed to do. In Warner Robins, Megan Western, 13 WMAZ News. Chief Fisher says they have compared crew to five similar businesses in their investigation. He says similar establishments have had less than half the number of complaints as crew and no homicide.